Hello everyone, Happy New Year, welcome to another video. Now for your information when I'm filming this video, at least in New Zealand time, it is the 1st of January 2026, about 7pm. But anyway, I want to show you that we have a pretty normal VM here. This is just Windows Vista Ultimate, it's 64-bit. So this isn't the first time I've done one of these rogue antivirus testing videos. What we do here is we search for exe files. Uh, my bad, it's star.exe what yes so we're going to run pretty much all of these uh, will it let me run them all sure probably not right uh, no all right so it's started next oh my god it's already going quite poorly for us now i can't even allow all these to run it's lagging so badly oh my god that's so fugly just install everything okay sure we'll just do that one as well i agree we'll run it set up adware pro yes adware alert and we're just gonna close this because i don't really need any more adware stuff this application doesn't work on Windows Vista. Okay, let's try and close just the active windows we have. Okay, so it's found three threats in the form of cookies. And we want to keep it on. We'll unlock everything. Okay, and here we go. 47 pieces of compromising content have been detected in your computer. Jeez, that's not bad. I thought it'd be more than that, but your PC has stored 47 items that are dangerous to your reputation. You can never be 100% sure that your internet activities... Oh my god, get out of here. Ah... You can never be 100% sure that your internet activities are private when others can access your computer at work or at home. The found evidence may cause monitoring and investigation of your computer without your awareness. Accidental or purposeful disclosure of adult materials stored in your PC. Strong disapproval of your addiction to XXX websites. High risk to your career and marriage and other embarrassing consequences. And I love this extra down the bottom to protect your family slash career slash property and get rid of these compromising contents you need to hide them completely by means of advanced cleaner and it wants us to register now so we can't actually do that now by the way none of this is even so it's found the two files in the recycle bin which apparently are severely bad and we have two typed urls which are the downloads folder and the microsoft go page the ie history we opened up one file which i think is just explorer viewing history recently accessed the desktop and backup files so we're just gonna close that and we have another one saying that potentially dangerous files were found on your system during last scan it is highly recommended to remove them as soon as possible and what do we have down here so we have two different ones advanced privacy suite is saying it's highly recommended to activate and advanced security tool 2010 has detected that somebody is trying to transfer my private data over the internet so apparently the remote user computer name is windows vista so i don't know whether that's supposed to be me or the other user and the ip address address my local ip so we're gonna allow the attack and this fugly one over here says 20 potential threats found and we'll click this flashing button that does nothing oh but it opens a payment portal that doesn't exist anymore okay cool and it's found spam tools it's like this thing it's alphacleaner.com sure yep do it and we have win hdd and it says hard drive doesn't respond to system commands that's a critical error bad sectors or damaged fat boot sector of the disk is damaged ram memory temperature is 83 degrees celsius this is all just rubbish but if you click on run defrag this is like some fake defrag that's not even real okay we'll just minimize that we'll run some more of these why not let's run these ones there we go i think there's only so many you can run no we're not going to download anything antivirus scan needs to download virus definitions go okay ang antivirus 2009 is looking pretty ugly and it's still installed as well okay anti-malware 2009 sure the future is here guys anti-spyware bot yeah oh what was that what was that one that was fugly hold on leave 
Get out of here. Not that not that one, although that is ugly. Or this one. There was another one that was just... I can't close this either. A Vera... Anti-Vera, sorry, my bad. No, we don't want that. Antivirus 10? Is that like Windows 10? Warning, your system is infected. Last system scan found virus infections on your PC. So apparently my bank account, Facebook, and Twitter data is going to get stolen. Just realize down here it says that we need to start the scanner. So that's important. And antivirus, not sure which one, has found 414 viruses on your computer. So let's ignore these threats. What do we got here? IE Monster from the IE Setup DLL. What is it? You got antivirus 10, but it's Windows 7. I think it means 2010 is probably... Okay, Remote Spy is suspected to have infected your PC, but I guess we're not sure. Server.exe and nothing's lined up properly. Let's block the attack now. Oh, but you gotta pay though. Continue unprotected. And we got this very legit looking Windows... Oh my god. Look at that. In the corner. New upgrades are available. Oh, that that's... That's terrible. And, but you have to buy it though. Anyway, Microsoft Windows. Oh my god, look at that. What is this, bro? Oh, get out of here. I can't even do anything. Oh, here we... Oh my god. Microsoft Windows recommends that you register your antivirus software to get the latest protection against malicious intruders. Please note that unregistered applications are usually unable to clean infected systems and thus, registered version of antivirus 10 is required. Would you like to register antivirus 10 now and get all available upgrades? No. For the, like, fifth time I've tried to read this one, Microsoft Windows has detected infection of backdoor Dooza B in your system. Oh my god, go away. This back door is remotely controlled by an attacker whose aim is to get passwords and credit card details from infected computer. And we're going to go, don't remove. Cannot close the application. For your security, some settings are controlled by your system administrator. Can I actually change it? No, I can't. Okay. And we strongly recommend to delete the threats before they inflict unrecoverable damage to your PC. I'm going to continue unprotected. Thank you. And I can't even do anything with that one. It's just sitting there. Can we run... This is gonna keep popping up. Task Manager, didn't think Task Manager. One, oh, Antivirus 10 is blocking Task Manager with this, again, very fugly and fake looking, I mean, totally legit looking Defender window from Windows 7, saying this app has been blocked for your protection. Windows has blocked the execution. Oh my God. Your children catch colds. Your computer catches viruses. Protect your computer as if it was one of your own. This has to be one of the most annoying ones I've ever seen. We've still got more though, don't even, yeah, sure. And it's like Spy Sheriff, if you know that. Oh my god, that gave me a fright. The hell was that? Trojan Red Browser. Okay. Yeah, I want to continue unprotected. Oh, infected files found. This is... What tool is this? And it just opened up this website, which I can't probably say out loud. And it's just opening everything. Attention, the security of your computer has been compromised. Microsoft Windows files are now corrupted. Malicious software, which can lead to irreversible damages to your hard drive, have been found on your system. The destruction of important files in C slash Windows could lead to data loss, system errors, and hard drive failure. Click yes to remove malicious software and protect your PC. Recommended. God, get out of here. Just remind me later. Yes, I'm sure. Ignore. And we got this fake security center. Warning, Windows. Oh, it's trying to open up Viagra.com now. And warning, Windows has detected virus infection. Somebody is trying to get access to your system files and steal your passwords. Prevent identity theft and remove viruses now. This one's highly recommended. What's the bet this is going to be antivirus 10? Yes, it is. Get the hell out of here. Okay, let's just keep going. Let's let's go through some more of these. So we'll close that. And let's go like these ones here. Allow. What the? Which one is that? Where's that even coming from? Okay. Okay, yeah, install. I, I don't even know what that is. Says Antivirus Solution 2010. It might just be called setup.exe, I suppose. Security mechanic, ugly. No, I don't want to upgrade. Thank you. Setup, what? Let's get these ads again. This is actually not a terrible looking ad, but just get out of here, man. 
Uh, we got smart antivirus, and all of these have apparently been found, so we're going to re remove all spyware, but we can't, so we'll continue unprotected. But look at this. Ooh, this just looks so bad. Unregistered version, and it's got all these settings that you can't do anything without buying them. You can close these, enable automatic updates, update now. No, you can't even do anything without buying anything. ANG antivirus again, internal software conflict, some application endeavors to access your system kernel. We're going to continue unsecured and it's antivirus solution 2010 again, this is probably my favorite rogue ever. Yep, spyware isolator, whatever that was. Here's one that's actually fitting, we have Vista Home Security 2012. Now I believe it, this one here specific... All right, now I gotta read this one. Viruses, oh, get out of here. Attention, spyware isolator has detected malware objects on your PC. These objects have to be immediately destroyed. Otherwise your PC may become vulnerable to the following threats. All your passwords and keys stored with password manager will be sent to third parties. Your PC will display unwanted advertisements and pop-ups like this thing. Your computer will be slowed down. Your internet connection speed will decrease. Music and software will be downloaded to your PC from the web without your consent. You may get pop-ups and annoying ads when you're online and sometimes even when you're offline like right now your default home page will be changed without your consent you may get extra toolbars installed without your consent you may receive much more spam emails than ever before so we're gonna go re register and we'll close that now something that's fascinating is this has just caused a massive not PTSD but just nostalgia because this was the first ever rogue that I legitimately got infected by and I don't know how back in the day. This attention danger. So it was whatever this home security family is that must have got me. So it says that system scan for spyware, adware, trojans and viruses is complete. Vista Home Security 2012 detected 32 critical system objects. These breaches may be exploited and lead to the following. Your system becomes a target for spam and bulky intruding ads. Browser crashes frequently and web access speed decreases. Your personal files, documents, passwords get stolen. Your computer is used for criminal activity behind your back. Bank details and credit card information gets disclosed. Click register. No. Your PC is still under malware attack. Let's leave it unprotected. I'm gonna close this. What have we got? Nine vulnerabilities found. This is actually really good. This one looks pretty legit. It's just not quite correct. It's actually just this text here that's wrong. We've got Spy Snipe with this little army guy. And... Real old school unks will know this as the Spy Sheriff sort of... There's a particular set of rogues that this family has been around for a very long time so we'll just go remove spyware we can't so we'll close it that's fine i don't think we're ever gonna get a like a nice moment with our computer ever again it is so slow and you can see it's trying to open this report about bosn.com whatever that is i know better than to go looking it up antivirus 10 will not go away by the way i just can't close it advanced security tool 2010 we got a block that's the same attack as before do not yes go away system doctor yeah sure unblock it system security system security has found threats on your computer activate antivirus now uh i don't think i will though what the hell is this what is this it's lit this is the worst thing i've ever seen apparently this this identity theft attempt was detected system security has found threats on your computer activate antivirus now no i'm good this thing is trying to steal our microsoft windows keys and antivirus software is not activated so that's not good can we prevent the attack apparently we we could so that's good oh it's just opening everything and internet explorer is now blocked so we're gonna have to know continue oh my. please smart protector i believe this is think point this this looks really good by the way system security has oh found threats God. on your computer activate antivirus now this looks really perfect, by the way, so let's go clean computer. Now, of course, this actual prompt does not tell you to scan online, but we'll just roll with it anyway. And we're gonna, we're just gonna turn the website safety off. Turn off the protection. What is this? Firewall protection. Please register system security. 
System Security has found threats on your computer. Activate antivirus now. Are you sure you yeah, want to continue unprotected? What is this? Please register. Are you sure you want to Computer continue unprotected? unprotected. Can, can... Your system may be at risk. Oh my god. Continue unprotected is a security risk. Yes, I'm sure, but I can't even close Please it. Please register oh. system security to continue. I can't even close it. Are you sure yes. you want to continue oh, unprotected? Far out. Your system may be at risk. I can't get rid of this one. Alright, solution found. Okay, yeah, do it. Think point update failed. System security I, I has found threats on your computer. Activate antivirus yeah, now. I heard you the first time, but I can't do anything. Cancel upgrade. Allow the attack. Oh, continue unprotected. Okay, yes. Whoa, what was that? What was our wallpaper? Okay, I hope that this thing actually does restart. And if so, I hope we get to see what that wallpaper was. Okay, so we got ThinkPoint, world's leading security solution, but we also have Adware Pro, which has made it through. So we're just gonna close Adware Pro for now, and we have to do a safe startup. So if you're unaware of ThinkPoint and this like fake security essentials clone family, what they actually do is hijack the startup shell. So rather than Explorer loading, it just loads this every time. It's loading its self-control. Okay, ThinkPoint is performing a full scan. It's very odd. So apparently Task Manager is infected, but you can get around it by saving this unprotected startup setting. Don't know if you can close it until it's finished with its scanning though. Okay, so we're going to continue unprotected. And your system has been infected with multiple spyware programs. You should consider installing the necessary heuristic module to protect your computer. Also, you are to install the module to protect other computers, as well as your PC has repeatedly tried to infect other computers via internet and to send spam. The fact of spamming can result in criminal prosecution, despite the fact that you are the victim of malicious software. For the safety of your system, it is essential for you to install the necessary heuristic module and perform a full scan of your computer to exterminate malicious programs from it. So we're going to go continue unprotected. And we in now. Oh my god. Can't even do anything. So hopefully this time there should be a few less of these around. And none of these want to be closed, by the way. There's so many. All of the hits, all the classics are here, by the way. Okay, alright. Yup. Thanks, guys. I'm really feeling protected now. Okay, leave. Yup. Sweet. No. Wait, what? Press yes to exit or, or no, but you can't press yes. Okay, I guess I guess we'll just install it then. Whatever, I don't care. And we'll, I can't even get rid of this one. System security, network attack detected. I'm really fighting a losing battle with these pop-ups, man. They're really... Can we show the desktop? Yes! Warning, you're in danger. Your computer is infected with spyware. All you, oh, oh, get out of here, go away. All you do with computer is stored forever in your hard disk. When you visit sites, send emails, all your actions are logged and it is impossible to remove them with standard tools. Your data is still available for forensics and in some cases, for your boss, your friends, your wife, your children. Every site you or somebody or even something like spyware opened in your browsers with all the images and all the downloaded and maybe later removed movies or mp3 songs are still there and could break your life. Secure yourself right now. Remove all spyware from your PC. You know, I think one of the problems with this message is as great and grammatically correct and logical as it is, it doesn't say what software we're supposed to be using to do that because we're not exactly short on choice. With the wise words of system security saying that you're or we're in danger, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. I hope you had a great 2025 and you have an even better 2026. Hopefully, I'll see you all again next time.